Health experts are continuing to tell you to get vaccinated against measles because the number of cases in our state just continues to grow. As we have reported, there are no confirmed cases on the west side of the state, but there are two locations in Kent County where people could have been exposed last Friday. 39 year side Shanna Grove spent today reviewing immunization waivers for West Michigan students to see if there's a local concern for kids. Shanna. Hey Nick, that's right, and we should note of the 43 cases in Michigan this year, the majority involve adults, but measles can cause serious health complications, especially in kids younger than five. I visited the Ottawa County Department of Public Health, where there's a higher percentage of unvaccinated students than other West Michigan areas. The percentage of students with immunization waivers in most West Michigan counties is below the state average, but that's not the case in Ottawa. There's a medical reason to get a waiver and that would be signed by a doctor. But Michigan parents sign a vast majority of waivers for philosophical reasons. If it's a non-medical reason being philosophical or religious, then you come to the health department in your local county meet with a public health nurse who provides education, explains the risks. The state average for students with an immunization waiver is 3.6%. Ottawa County usually does really well on health indicators, but in this case, um, we're the worst in the counties around the Lakeshore and in West Michigan. In Ottawa, it's 3.9%, ranking 45th out of 83 counties and Detroit. Among our population, we like to have 95% of people vaccinated. So when we look at children, we do hit that 95% threshold as a county. But when we look in individual pockets, um, specific school buildings or specific groups of people, we don't meet that threshold. That's where the concern comes from. It varies from, you know, almost 0% of waivers up to uh, maybe one out of four students are waivered. So there is a range. So one out of four, that's 25% or more waivers in a school. That is not the herd immunity that we need. That's that's a very vulnerable situation right there and people are at risk. Ottawa County hasn't seen a measles case since 1991. Due to the measles outbreak that's occurring on the east side of the state, we are having physician offices calling us and parents calling us with questions about getting their unvaccinated children vaccinated. And Lake County is another outlier on the west side of the state with 5.4% of students waived. We reached out to the health department there and are waiting to hear back. If you would like to know more about the percentage of waivers in your school or county, we have a link on our website at 13onyourside.com. Nick.